Welcome, everyone, to the L7C podcast, Naruto What If Battle Edition. Today, we have the NDP Naruto crew of Justin, Nikki, Cedric, and Andrea with us today as we are going to be talking about Tamari War Arc version versus Conan. But before we start all of that, uh, Justin, how are you doing today, sir? Doing swell. Drank a lot of Duce last night, so I'm a little hungover but i'm good oh, that's my shit good. <laughs> andrea how are you doing today ma'am i'm all right i slept in pretty late today so i'm feeling very well rested although maybe a little underprepared so sorry guys nikki how are you doing today sir i'm chilling taking it easy cedric how are you doing today sir I'm hungover as fuck. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> I'm here. So I am a little nervous. I want to keep saying I'm prepared. I'm like laying down. So we're going to figure this out. Yeah, we'll we get are, through it. We are missing our captain, though. He is um, very preoccupied right now. Let me go on the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't even going to say that, but I was just going to say I was very just saying, Justin, you outed him like that? That's messed up. <laughs> Absolutely. I mean, he was going to out him now rather than later. He may out him later, too, when he comes in here. Because <laughs> I was wondering if Marvel was going to introduce him as, like, being here, but just not ask him or anything. But, uh, well, we'll see. Go now. <laughs> Since he wants to push it to two and then decides to poop <laughs> at 155. <laughs> <laughs> he wanted to go to his nephew's flag football game. That got canceled at three, and he's like, "Oh, y'all want to push it on the toilet?" Okay, it is what it is. I mean, it's well, I made it to the game. Shoot, he's been on the toilet. Si was up here. He knew that shit was going to get canceled. He had plenty of time to use the bathroom. That's why the the, okay. the listeners are going to hear about his shit. Literally. Well, I don't. Hear that. <laughs> I was going to say, I ain't trying to hear all that. All right, let's get into it right now. Uh, Tamari versus Conan, two women who are. Very um, underappreciated by a lot of the Naruto fandom, besides us. And if these two know the rules, 60, well, we haven't even done the time limits, but they meet at the random grassy player, Perry Plane. Nikki, who do you have and why? Uh, honestly, I don't know. Like, I've read this. Mm-hmm. And I'm a huge fan siblings fan. I'll be honest. I'm a big Tamari fan. I, I honestly, I'm gonna give it to Conan. I don't think Tamari can take down the Katsuki level members yet, even in the war arc. Okay. I'll be honest, because okay. I mean, this lady Conan went toe to toe with Toby. Andrew, in this matchup, who would you have winning? I. I struggled trying to decide and I, I still like to this second can't really 100% put my faith in one or the other. I'm leaning towards Tamari at this moment because just rewatching some of the fights, unless I miss something y'all truly, I might've missed something. I haven't seen Conan do anything taijutsu wise tamari doesn't do too too much again both underappreciated characters so they don't have a lot of fighting time but at least if things do have to get physical she's able to use her fan as kind of more of a staff so i feel like they both cancel each other out with long distance ranged attacks so if things get close i feel like tamari would take it especially since um, like Nikki mentioned that she went that Kona went toe to toe with Toby. That was with a lot of preparation, a lot of prior knowledge of Toby's abilities. And this is uh, the grassy plain just out in the open. Think on your feet. Both of them are incredibly intelligent and uh, can fight and think on their toes. But I, I do think it might go to Tamari. Okay. Justin, who would you have in this one? I think I will go with um, Tamari in this one on the account that um, I think she can do more than um, Conan can. Conan really just has the paper. And um, when, like Andrea said, when she um, came very close to beating um, Toby, um, she had a lot of preparation. She knew exactly what she was dealing with in our little scenario. She's not going to really know what Tamari can do. So I 
think I'm going tomorrow. Actually, I'm not thinking. I know I'm going tomorrow here. Okay. Cedric, who would you go with? I'll go tomorrow. Just like that, nice and easy. I told y'all, man. It's one of them days, but I'm just going simple. Rock, paper, scissors. She uses paper. <laughs> paper needs air. Tamari uses wind. And those are beats box, so it's all fine. So. Yeah, it's but in all seriousness, it's like, I'll, I'll give it to Tamari just also like, we're our Tamari. We don't really see her use the summoning as much as most people remember from the retrieve bitch boy <laughs> chronicles. <laughs> Can we stop the Sasuke slander? Oh, here we go. He's, Jesus Christ. I've been editing all these goddamn podcasts and it's just a, Sa- a Sasuke fucking rag fest every goddamn episode. Like, damn. Can we can we give the man some respect? You don't even know what juice this nigga uses. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I made a easy mistake. Okay. It's not it easy. A, it, it, was a, it, it, was, it was a simple mistake. Plenty of people have probably mistaken that shit too. We're not plenty of people though. No, no, no the worst part no, is when you is realize blind. love is blind. Love is blind. <laughs> when you just realize you made the mistake, you even said yourself, this nigga is ass. Oh, I'm not saying I'm not saying he doesn't suck. But put some respect <laughs> on his name. That, that's the man who went into the cave summit and got his ass beat. It takes balls. Okay. That nigga got big cojones, okay? He went in there. He thought he was really going to win. Hey, that's the only reason he went there. Hey, that's respect. He went in there and got his ass beat like a man. I can respect twice. that. And he got killed twice. So, Justin, since so why did, so because of that, he deserves more respect. That is what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah. I, 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 as, the, as the clear antagonist slash rival of the show, I think you guys disrespect him more than he, he deserves. Okay, no, hold on, hold I'm on. Not, listen, I ain't even gonna. I, uh, that's another that, whatever. I don't even <laughs> give a damn. But moving on, and then we retrieved to Chiha Sasuke. All right, she had that summoning jutsu, which was pretty nice with the weasel with the scythe. Mm-hmm. I haven't seen Conan do much too much. I will say, like, she does have an interesting technique with her chakra nature being able to turn her whole body into paper as well as using paper clones and hiding the explosives in it so with the preparation thing that was a real big thing of her fight with obito being able to make like what was it a billion or something paper bombs and looks like a noah part in the sea with paper bombs but at least with the paper clones in a pinch i think she'd be able to get some off but i don't know if she can get close to tamari because again having to get through long distance and being able to fly as well so she doesn't really have like the clear height advantage of being above Tamari even when she uses the wings because Tamari can ride the fan and I think no matter how much you harden your paper which is be like Shuriken I mean we saw what happened when Tintin fought Tamari those mm-hmm. didn't reach so the only thing I would say with Conan's paper though is that it didn't get melted when it went toe to toe with like Jiraiya's fire release bullet because she did have a like the only two fights we see her fight is the skirmish with him and then Toby. I mean, obviously Jiraiya was stronger than Conan, but she did hold her own a bit until like one of the pain's bodies got there. Those are the only two fights she has in the show, but with Tamari. I guess I, I guess what Nikki said too, like her fighting at Kosky level people. I mean, she did try her best, like fighting against the Rakage's dad until Naruto got there. Well, I will also say she fought like that was like just the Kage reanimation. Like all mm-hmm. those fucking Kages were there. Like who's what who the third Sushi Kage, yep. the second Mizu Kage. I think as far as like we've seen with tomorrow, I mean, I don't know, Conan. I won't say t- Conan's not intelligent. Conan is definitely intelligent as she can prep a fight, but I don't know if she can prep mid fight as well as Tamari. Because these two, I guess these two women, would it be in agreement that they're in the top seven you, strongest women in the show to this point? I would say so, I think. Yes. Yeah. Mm. 
Because I was trying to think how many people are stronger than those two at that point in time. Uh, oh, the Rock. Friday. Mm-hmm. Uh, four, Mizukage. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. If anything, there's the. Uh, what about the chick from the uh, Rock Village? Don't you say it. I see you running. Don't you dare say. <laughs> you no, know I'm not about to say Sakura. You know not at this know. time. No. No, not at that time. A woman, woman. Who else? Who else? <laughs> She should have got smoked right then and there. Because they might be third and fourth. That's a if how many women in like at this current time are stronger than Tamari and Conan right now? Besides Tsunade and the fourth Mizukage that um Justin just said. I don't remember her name, but what about the chick from is it the Cloud Village that marries? I don't know. I'm like just Toji? thinking of other strong women and she's a bunch of that can really she pop sucks. into my mind. <laughs> Oh, she's 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 good. She's good. That one with Mary Choji, right. she sucked. Narsha should have put her ass down when she Man, came and punched him. In the, oh my god, that's true. That's, that's very true. Again, talk about Sasuke took everybody. our leader. Man, I was like, okay, so you want to pick a fight with the Nine Tails over? I was like, all right, that makes no sense, but okay, okay. But no, that that's a good one on y'all. The one who becomes the future, she's. Well, would you say she's stronger than Tamari at that point? No, that's a good. So you have two current Kages, the one future one, and you probably have these two as the strongest women right now. And yet these two got zero screen time. Yep. I'm like, <laughs> 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 bl- I blame I blame I blame soccer for yeah. taking screen time away from them. I, what? Well, I mean. It was, it was her show, too. Shit. Unfortunately. The only women who really get shy in that show are Tsunade and her. Whoa, chill. Now I'm trying to think, too. Man. Because you think, well, now she's a mom. Now I was going to say, do you think that Tamari could have beat uh, Kurenai? Kurenai? Asuma's wife? Baby? I agree. Oh, that, the Genjutsu the- user. Mm-hmm. Now, Kira is not good. I think she sucks personally. No. Boom! The one fight you saw her was against Itachi. That's a bad look. Yeah, that, I was, that was a bad and look. She, and she was terrible. <laughs> you don't think I mean, Asuma she sucks? Knows his <laughs> uh, no, I think he does too. But you think you know. Asuma what? sucks? Oh, oh. what? Oh. Damn, bro. <laughs> that sucks that or not? Wow. Nigga. That nigga trash. Okay, that, you're comparing that, him to his oh, other Joni oh, oh, to Kakashi oh, 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 this guy. That, <laughs> all that nigga do is punch. <laughs> Punching uh, is very effective. So does God. He can use all five chakras. Oh, no, no, no. There, 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 there'll be no Mike God slander coming from this way. That nigga is hard. But you just said all <laughs> you said all Asma does is punch. Yes, he, he, he does. He can do fire jutsu on, on the level expert of- level. Come on, man. Like I'm not sitting here trying to say he's sweet or anything, but he he I like sucks is bad, bro. That's you can't say someone yeah. sucks in the Naruto verse. That's bad. Like for real, for real though, like out of their class, there's only two Joni that actually matter. That's Kakashi and Guy, but like well shit, yeah, he was so I, goddamn good he wanted to die against fucking <laughs> Hidon. What oh no. man, anyone without the knowledge of Hidon would have died against Hidon though. Justin, on our Akatsuki what if battle, we right. almost didn't push Sasuke through. Right, I yeah. know, and that's from pure. That's because that's you guys hate him. No, oh, no. he has no hold on, hold on. Nigga, I'm the one that voted to push him through. <laughs> <laughs> that's watching. because, as just Cedric just said, he would have no knowledge of Hedon's abilities. He gets cut once, as remember, Justin. You also said Sasuke is an arrogant. He doesn't rush oh, yeah, at that point. And <laughs> the Russians try to Shidori Hedon and get cut. What? He's a Nagi. Yeah, you, you guys gotta stop with the Sasuke. I'm, I'm quite frankly sick. Right. Man, stop loving this man so much. Damn, the fans don't give that much a shit. <laughs> man, you just said because he died to heat. You're acting like he don't was an immortal. He's still in a ditch. <laughs> <laughs> to this day. I do want them to go back low key and show that ditch that Shikamaru did for him. Be like, yeah, yeah I'm still here. <laughs> so if it if there was planning, would you right. guys change your pick? Like if Conan I had would, like yeah. two days? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Because I the only reason Obito won was <laughs> Uchiha. Well, <laughs> yep, that's the only reason he won. <laughs> and ain't nobody, first of all, ain't nobody like 
knew because he he held that eye real good behind the mask. Everyone only saw the one. That, mm-hmm. Cause you, when I saw, man, I watched that. I saw Conan's face. I was like, yeah, I'd be shook too. Like this is some bullshit. Like I'd have made all these paper bombs. He for sure died. I watched that shit. And he came back and then stabbed me uh, with a I rod. Was in, I was in complete awe just watching that fight. I was like, she's about to do it. She's really about to do it. He said, I have a whole other eye. I mean, just because I cover it up doesn't mean it's not there. Yeah, but then, My man ripped it off. I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> then you cheat a bullshit factor like fucking LeBron James out here. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh my god. So if the so war arc tomorrow is seeming like that's who we're going with. And I guess like on a power scaling thing, nah. so that Might means well. she, she'd be a Koski level if she could beat Conan in a fight. So I mean is war arc well no, because war arc Sakura would beat her because she'd have the 100 healing thing. Mm-hmm. She'd beat Conan. But without war arc Sakura I think I think Conan's the strongest mm-hmm. girl in the of that like close to that age range at the at this point in time. Wait, it's not as like eighty something, so yeah. <laughs> like from like the Sakura, he not to all of them, I think Conan I mean not Conan, uh Tamari's the strongest, which I think that's who that's who we picked too for our tournament. We got heat for that. <laughs> because that's we didn't underestimate the Sakura. Yeah, because we underestimated Sakura because she lost to Hinata. And then in the comments, they were talking about if Sakura could punch her, she'd lose. We're like, whoa. Well. If. If it's good. <laughs> I, I don't know what to tell you, but you know, the strongest girl on the show until like the very end, no screen time, no respect, not shit. And what a life. Justin, man, where, where were you at to tell Kishimoto to give her more time? No, I was too busy worrying about Sasuke and his whereabouts to, <laughs> to be pre, to be preoccupied with the lack of screen time for the woman on the show. I mean, I'm just saying. I man. thought you were going to say you was studying the gospel of pain. I was going to say, oh, there it is. <laughs> that, that is true, too. We are pain. We are God in the middle of a suburban neighborhood. Oh, my God. I love that, man. <laughs> <laughs> God, if Payne was a real person, I'd love to meet him. Uh, Justin, he would put your ass... Show me the ways, Nagato, please. (laughs) Until he puts us all in the moon because he sees what type of lives we're living out here. That's what I mean. Of anyone, he probably put you in the moon first, Mario. You'd be trying to plan to take him down and shit. Who? Who put put me? Yeah, you'd be trying to... You'd have a plan like, I got a way to beat Payne. Just wait, just call it. Just let him step out of line. Come for me. I got him. He's like, well, we got to do this preemptively. I got to put you in the moon because you're going to try to kill me. Well, so here's the thing. Obviously, he's going to kill me, but I'm not getting put in the moon. I would not be disrespected like that. Point blank. <laughs> you ain't got no superpowers. <laughs> what you going to do? <laughs> well, hopefully in this perfect world, he shows up this and then we all get powers. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, quite frankly, should feel honored to be put in the moon by that man, honestly. I'm not yeah. getting I'm not getting put in the moon. The last time I see him, saw him try to put someone in the moon, Itachi looked at it, it's like, oh, the weakness is right in the middle. We're gonna throw shit at it. Oh, you're gonna get stabbed by the blade. You're going to the- sleep now. I'm like, hmm, That's all that work. And That's then Sasuke gets the running gone for literally two episodes, can randomly put all the I'm tail the beasts in the moon, no effort. And then gets to Boruto, forgets he has all these jutsus and becomes trash. He only got one hand. What you want from the guy, man? Well, now he can't use his whole other side of his damn body. He lost his eye. He lost his hand. He's probably going to lose his foot and neck. Oh, my God. Let me stop. Nope. <laughs> man can't make hand signs. He chose the running gun over making hand signs. I mean, shit, it was a clear power move, honestly. I know that damn village has more um, Senju cells. Give that nigga a new arm. We're just they offered go. it. He turned it down. He said, yeah, oh. this is my repentance. This was mm. me to repent for losing. All that blah, blah, blah. Well, That's, now that he lost his eye, he should probably give in and, you know, get a new arm. Oh. I mean, That's at well. this point, Loki, he may just want to just stop it. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> just stop fighting. <laughs> I mean, I'm just done. start teaching at this point, because I mean, like, I mean, Grant, actually, maybe not, because your one pupil is the one who took your eye. So that's kind of fucked up. I'm um, offended that that's a, that was Itachi's eye that just got stabbed, being bare. 
And that sad, is exactly why he's on the toilet. Sad, sad, sad. But all right, it looks like Tamari is out here clean, clean sweeping. I do think it would be a good fight, though. I don't think it'd be a oh, wash. Oh, for sure. No, yeah. yeah. I don't think it'd be a wash like some other people might think. But, yo, know, that's really it. Man, we went 27 minutes and Byron's still on that toilet. Crazy. <laughs> I was waiting for I was just holding on. I was just holding on to for him to hop in and say something, but did you tell him he could hop in? Because he may not be on the toilet. He just was like, oh. It it makes it easier to edit when he's not on. It's fine. (laughs) My man had to buy one, get one cheesy gordita crunch. He's like, they are my favorite. (laughs) Oh my god. (laughs) That ranch sauce did him wrong. I know, I know. This is like top five next month. Well, yeah, next month is another battle oh, yeah. of, like, I don't know, I want to say underutilized, but next month is Shikamaru versus I mean, Starwing, so. What? USB oh. announces stuff like this out of the blue, like, we all have right. a schedule or something. Like, well, what? Excuse you announce, me? Yeah, next time on, now I was going to say, next time on, like, NDP, <laughs> like, the Dragon Ball. I was going to say, you're starting to sound like this is a true episode. <laughs> no, wait, Daru, Black Kakashi? For, uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's wait, the only said, way I remember. You said Daru? Daru? Yeah, Black Kakashi. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I've fucked so so hard. Laser Circus is awesome, but I know Nikki Shikamaru is one of your favorites too. Wait, which Shikamaru? Well, shit. Do you want to do War? Yeah, War. That's fine. That's fine. One of them becomes a right Kage. Okay? Yeah, oh, it's right hand to the Hokage. Mm-hmm. That's power right there. Mm-hmm. We're giving these people some respect, but all right. Justin, first up, any final words? Um, stop disrespecting Sasuke. I Sorry. can't wait. I can't wait till we're done recording. <laughs> <laughs> Andrea, any other any final words for you? Nope, I don't think so. Cedric. This is a good episode. Good talk. Byron. <laughs> hopefully you're okay. Your butthole isn't bleeding. <laughs> uh, with that being said, thank you everyone for listening to the L7C podcast. Make sure you like, rate, comment, subscribe anywhere you listen to your podcast Apple, Google, Spotify. Or if you want to listen to them on YouTube, the L7C YouTube has the Naruto What If Battle playlist. So you can just go to the playlist and watch all of them back to back to back. Uh, with that being said, thank you all for listening and y'all take care. Thank you for listening to this episode of the L7C Podcast. Be sure to like, rate, review, and subscribe to the channel. Follow us on all social media platforms, and we'll be talking to you guys soon. Take care.